We beat to rap what key beat to lock, but I'm cool like that. You're now rocking with the best Luminary Sounds, the, the number one station for independent artists. I'm cool like that. I'm cool. Of course, I love that song. That song. I love Mel LaRue. Uh, right? Bryce Wilson. Right, my boy. You let's know Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. So, listen, it is a special, special moment. It is very special. We have Stacey Ryan in the building. <laughs> Luminary yeah. sound. She yeah. is here. Yes, the, I'm here. The one and only jazz queen. Jazz, the queen. jazz queen. Let me give you I'm some. I'm sure stats. you've heard that before. I I've gotten it a couple times. Yeah, so <laughs> let me let me get these stats out. You know, she, first of all, she got over 14.6 million YouTube views. Man, 1.4 on, tic, on TikTok. Stop playing. She made a song and got signed to Island Records in 19 days, bro. Man, swag. You are the jazz queen. I mean, you know, I kind of just like gave myself the title and it like no one ever said you're not that. So I was like, okay, let's, let's just keep it there then. I am the jazz the queen. Self-proclaimed. Self-proclaimed. So Good word. speaking of jazz, is that your favorite genre? Jazz? Um, yeah. It is? Yeah. I went to school for it. Okay. So um, it's just like it's infused in everything I do. Oh, I love that. And I, I just it. think it's such an underappreciated genre, especially like these That's what days. I'm talking about. You I knew know? you were going to say something because you, you are jazz. He, he is a jazz fan. I mean, it's so good. It's so good. What, so what, good. what instruments do you play? Um, I Piano is like the instrument that I played the longest. Okay. Um, and then in high school, I played the trumpet. So I okay. don't play anymore, but I probably, like, if I picked it up and started practicing, I might be yes. able to like play it's like riding sure. a bike okay um i took up guitar in quarantine i've started the bass a little bit i'm learning along the way so you took up the gu guitar in quarantine mm -hmm. interesting because my brother ha i didn't even have one my brother had a like an electric guitar and i would just go in the basement that's, and just play guitar all day that's wow. really awesome so just for some of our listeners that are not familiar with stacy ryan let them know where you're from how you got started? Because I know Junior mentioned some of your great your accolades, and it's outstanding. Yeah, you know so that's just a little bit, bro. That's I just did, a little I bit. Talk, you know, talking about Times Square and everything else. Oh, I, I mean, so many. Exactly. So, you know, if you could get into some of that, that'd be great. Yeah. Okay. Let me let me try to make this condensed. <laughs> um, so I'm from Montreal originally. Canada so in the house. Oh, Canada. Um, Do you say a? Uh, I don't think I do because I've spent so much time in the States. When it, when did you come to the States? So I've been coming like on and off since October of last okay. year. Okay. And I've been like, you know, just writing and doing stuff. But I, I said before I went to jazz school. So it's the schooling in Quebec, the province that I'm from, is like hey. really complicated for no reason. Like you finish high school and then instead of going to like get your bachelor's degree right away, right. you get like an associate's degree first. Wow. Okay. So, but it, it, for us, it's called a college degree. So I have a college degree in Canada, which <laughs> okay. is an associate's degree here. Okay. And I did that in jazz interpretation. So that was the program wow. that I was in. And vocal was my instrument. So nice. I had classes uh, like every week and arrangement classes and all that stuff. And then I graduated that, went on to university to get my bachelor's now in the same program, jazz interpretation. But halfway through, I was like kind of feeling this like... This is dog? Oh, yeah. That's awesome. Yeah. She's the, she's the best. <laughs> okay. All right. Yeah. Um, halfway through, because I started talking with my manager and I was like, I kind of want to take a semester off, see where I can go. You know, you never know, right? Right. So you I never gra know. you never if we never try, how will we know, right? <laughs> um, I graduated my semester on December fifteenth, and then December 29th, the open verse challenge video went up, and then everything oh, wow. changed. That's like fourteen nuts. days later. And then what was that? Island just calls you. <sighs> that somebody was... sent you a DM. So wow. When everything was blowing up with Don't Text Me When You're Drunk, I was getting emails from record labels in my inbox. Wow. It was like, hey, this is so-and-so from Capitol Records. And I was like, oh, my gosh. Wow, that's exciting. So I was just like, I You didn't hang up on him? I mean, I didn't even know what to <laughs> respond. I was like, how do I respond to this someone from right. this huge record label? Right, right. So I just forwarded everything to my manager and changed so it wasn't my email in like my bios anymore. Oh, yeah, because yeah, yeah, I was yeah. like, I was getting bombarded with emails. Wow. And then I, I, that was the most Zoom calls I've ever had before because we were talking to every label, we were talking to every publishing company, so and so agents. So you got to pick. 
who you wanted to be with. I mean, it wasn't like I didn't have a pick out of like all of them because, you know, mm-hmm. you go through, you meet them and then you do like the offer part and stuff like sure, that. So there's sure. more than just like one step. But okay. I'm so happy that we ended up with Island. They are literally the best. That's awesome. The I bet they're happy team. with you. I I think so. Yeah, it's been really fun recently, especially with everything happening now with Fall in Love Alone. Yes. And yeah, yeah, see, that was a way long winded answer for where we started (laughs) at. It's it's okay. It's okay. We needed to know. It makes sense sense to me. I'm cool with it. I'm cool with it. Um, I do want to play this. We had a fan, right, that created something because you were here. So I'm going to play it right now. It's it's a little shocking, but here it is. I'm going to give you a little snippet. (laughs) Okay. Like, yeah, they did tattoo. They that did. song is so like they did tattoo. Hidden. Right. What? That's amazing. Can right. you send that to me? So I, who abs- did it? I absolutely will send it. So oh, we have a surprise. That person is in the room. Oh my gosh. You take who do you think it was? Is it you? It was I wish it was oh me. <laughs> so was it you? No. Oh my god. Who is it? There's is it There's got th- th- three more left. There's is three it, more. Is it you? No. No, oh well, two more left. Oh my god. Was it <laughs> you? It was not. <laughs> So it was you. Wow. Isn't that great? Shout out to you. Yeah. Top 10. Hey. Top, 10. top 10 with the remake. I love that. You know what? I feel like that song gets overlooked because it's so old and like I wrote it way before I ever started anything. I think well, it's great. I want I want to send, well, send me that. Definitely. Well, definitely. There's drums in there too. There's more to it. Oh my god, amazing. Can't wait to listen to the whole thing. Car on the way home. <laughs> well, yeah, well, well what happened home. was is uh this is Top 10 our videographer. Uh, he also is a producer as well. He makes music. Very 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 talented. And he says, "Yo, I got this idea that she comes through. I'm going to go ahead and remake sample her voice." And I'm like, That's "Sure. Awesome. Go ahead and do it." So he sends me a few variations. I'm like, "Yo, this is this is dope. I think she's going to like it." And I love your action. I great. love it. That's great. I want it. That's great. That's, That's great. Awesome. That's awesome. That's awesome. Man. So I got to get something out the way first. I normally do this when people get in. Uh-oh. Oh. Dun, dun, dun. Okay. I got to get, oh, wow. I gotta, I gotta get my signature right that here. That is the nicest poster of me I've <laughs> ever seen in my <laughs> life. Well, that's okay. It, She's it, blushy. Yeah, so basically, oh yes, uh, this is what Luminary sounds. We definitely appreciate you. We have so much. To, we haven't even got started yet. I but you know, yeah, for Luminary sounds, we we love your music. We love your growth, and we're we're fans. Oh my God! Thanks, guys. <laughs> oh no, I don't know. I'm so bad at this. What do I write? Well, you you get to practice you bet, with you us. You have to start practicing. That's so true. Whenever people like line up after my shows and they're like, just write something on my shirt. I'm like, <laughs> what do you want me to write? And they're like, oh, anything. And you I'm can like, practice right there. Oh my God, you can practice. I just cool. I just kind of know. I gotta like talk out through my script. That's okay. Well, while she's going and getting the signature, we're gonna play her song "Fall in Love" alone.